Well, the PLP chairman is labeling the Free National Movement's planned protest over the ongoing power outages and proposed rate increase by the Grand Bahama Power Company as a late showing. The chairman questioning the credibility and the timing of the FNM's stance on the matter, suggesting that their actions come well after the issues have been highlighted. A day late and a dollar short. PLP Chairman Fred Mitchell is questioning the Free National Movement's announcement of a protest at the Grand Bahama Power Company over ongoing issues affecting residents. Mitchell is criticizing the FNM's sudden activism, suggesting it appears to be more politically motivated than a genuine effort to address the concerns of Grand Bahamians. Mitchell pointing out that the FNM's planned protest comes weeks after two similar protests were held against the Grand Bahama Power Company, both attended only by Central Grand Bahama. MP Hiram Lewis. They called in Hiram Lewis uh, about a week or so ago and hauled him over the coals for being involved in the last public demonstration uh, that took place in Freeport. So it seems to me that this is kind of double speak that they're engaged in. And uh, so fine, everybody who comes to the table and says they're opposed to it, great. But, you know, there's a credibility issue with relation to the leader of the opposition on this matter. The chairman says that while the PLP welcomes all efforts to advocate for the residents of Grand Bahama, such actions should be rooted in sincere advocacy rather than opportunistic grandstanding. Mitchell also calls into question the FNM leader's indecisiveness on the issues at hand. Well, my feeling is that if you're... If you're against the rate increase, you should jump in with both feet and say that right at the start. You shouldn't be equivocating. And what he did was he equivocated. He said, oh, well, I'm against the increase after, of course, the public demonstrations took place and Mr. Lewis showed up on the first demonstration. We heard nothing from him. And then as the pressure increased, he said, oh, I'm against the rate increase. But at the same time, I support the Grand Bahama Port Authority. Well, you know, this is having your cake and eating it, too. You need to be clear. As the proposed GBPC rate increase, hike in fuel surcharge, and frequent power outages remain hot-button issues in Grand Bahama, the debate has drawn strong responses from both political parties and the wider community. PLP chairman reiterates the government's firm stance on the matter. We do not think that the Grand Bahama Port Authority has the jurisdiction to deal with this matter. This is a matter for IRCA. And that's our position, simpliciter, without any adornment or any uh, garnish, anything. That is our position. And we support all those who oppose it.